channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here. Hi, my name is Gloria and if you want to join the Hub Barbie Squad, just subscribe. You can also follow me on Instagram, I'll leave it somewhere around here and we can have chit chats and just, you know, have fun together and join the Hub Barbie Squad because everyone here is amazing. We're like the coolest squad ever. So if you want to join, it is that simple. Just subscribe and also follow me on Instagram because I post generally daily there so we can have chit chats um i post things about makeup products and also post some makeup look videos and yeah so today's video is my october favorites how on earth is october already ending like i feel like it just started it is so crazy i just i can't believe where does time go it is nearly christmas though so i am super excited i love christmas i am that person that decorates in november the first week of november and I'm not even ashamed of it. I am proud of it. I just can't wait to decorate. You can see I do have some twinkly lights up already because, you know, them Christmas feels. I am just so excited and I just can't wait to decorate my whole room. And now my new area. Let me know if you like my new background or if I should go back to the old one. This is where my makeup is stored. So I kind of thought I would change it up and do a video here. Um, but let me know if you'd like the old one better and yeah, we can switch it up between both of them I guess if you guys like that. So today's video is like I said my October favorites I have not had that many favorites this month. I've kind of stuck to the ones that I had last month But I've had a couple of items that just like start for me. By the way, I'm so sorry I just realized I have eyeliner there. I was swatching something. We'll just we'll just ignore that and let's get started in no particular order I'm just gonna pull out something from my little area of my little box of favorites now my first favorite has been this like scarf kind of like they call it a shawl I'm not too sure but you know how those people fancy people they wear like that thing when they wear a dress yeah I think it's called a shawl I think so but this is just a rose gold I call it a scarf um, it is super super pretty. It is springtime here in Sydney, so it's starting to get really hot But not like there's days where it's really hot and then there's days where it's raining and cold and you're just like pick one pick one um, But I found that this was really really good and handy It's not too thick and it's really trendy. I feel like that is the word for it. It is trendy It's rose gold love rose gold everything rose gold. I'm just a sucker for so that was a bonus but it's just, it's not too thick, it's good to wear um, in those warmer nights but when you still, there's like a little bit of a chill so it's like the in-between seasons and it really dresses up an outfit like I was wearing an all black outfit, black jacket, black um, top with black jeans and black booties and I wore this and it just added a pop of colour and just took my outfit to that next level but yeah, I got this from Levisa and I absolutely love it Levisa is a jewellery store so yeah, I don't know why they were selling scarves, but I mean, you know what? It worked really, really well. And I guess they were selling scarves because this is pretty much like a jewelry piece. It's just really, really stunning. And yeah, I've been absolutely loving this for the month of October. The next thing I have been loving, like how Instagram me and YouTube of me, is my Starbucks sippy cup. Now this was $15.95. Um, and yeah, I'm just so, yeah, I, I, I don't generally like, it's really weird. I don't like Starbucks coffee. I find it really weird. Like it's not my favorite coffee ever. Um, I do like their like iced teas, um, you know, their chocolate, their chocolate, I don't know what it's called. It's like a chocolate blended chocolate chip thing. That is really good. Um, yeah, I try to be Instagramy and YouTube and try like the green tea frappuccino and things like that. But nah, not for me. I mean, if you like that, that's you do your honey boo boo. But I do not like that stuff. But I wanted to be a bit Instagramy and YouTubey and get a sippy cup because, like, I mean, it's so cute and it's so like just I don't know. But like, look, if I just put it here, like, it just looks so cute. Like, I just love it. So. Yeah, I literally put smoothies in here, I make some iced coffee at home and I put it in here. Um, I use it for water. It's just so cute and just so handy to have. And I mean, when you have a cute little tumbler thing, it just makes you want to drink water and everything so much more. So, I have been loving this. This has helped me stay hydrated because it's just cute. And yeah, like I said, packaging, I'm a sucker for. So, 
been loving that. The next thing I've been loving is super random and it is an eye mask. Now I got this from Peter Alexander. Now I love that store. It's just so cute and so pretty but the problem is is that it's just so expensive and I mean I like to like go in and see because sometimes it has like sales on um, and I mean like it's pajamas and they're so cute and I don't want to spend unnecessary money like it's really priced some of them are really priced like wow you're just like okay I'm wearing this to sleep I'm not wearing this out to a night out or I'm not wearing this to like a prom thing I'm not wearing this to a formal I'm just wearing this to bed but this was on sale and this is the breakfast and Tiffany's collection and it's an eye mask and it's super super cute and I love it so much I don't like things on my face um, and I feel I felt weird about it to begin with and then I started wearing it more and more and seriously like I am a light sleeper like when I see sunlight or when I hear a noise I'm awake but this just eliminates all sunlight so when I do open my eyes it looks dark and then when I'm in my like waking up zone, I'm just like, oh, it's still night time. Sleep, Gloria, what are you doing? So it is amazing. I feel like I sleep so well with this. I love it so much. Now, I have tried other eye masks and they don't compare to this in the sense that I feel like some other eye masks are like really, really thin. This actually is thicker and it's got a cushion. So it's not thin where you can see a little bit of light it's literally pitch black which i really really like this is one of the best sleeping masks i've ever used i mean the cushion and the thickness really is comfortable and the thickness really does block out all light so i have been loving this the next thing i have been loving is this little victoria secret bag crossbody it could be a crossbody bag um or like a little side you wear it to the side like this it is such a cute bag now i love this bag um i got it for my camera which it does house my camera but recently i needed a small clutch to take to, with me to a concert and i brought this with me and i absolutely loved it it was so convenient it fits so much it has a little pocket at the back which is super nice um and then you open it up and it's just it's got the little pocket here and it's just it fits so much it's crazy like it's so small but yet fits so much and it's got such a really pretty look to it it's got victoria's secret here i really really love it and i love it for my camera it fits my camera absolutely perfectly the next thing i have been loving is a beauty product now i don't know if it's because the new huda beauty palette came out and I haven't picked it up yet. Let me know if you picked it up and what you think about it in the comments down below because I'm still iffy about it. I came to the conclusion that I wasn't using my rose gold palette enough for me to buy the new one. And then I kept thinking about it and I, see, I saw it on Instagram people were using the new palette. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to start using my rose gold palette. And guys, I have been loving this palette this month. Uh, like I said, I think it's because the new palette has come out that I'm just trying to use this one and justify getting the new palette because I'm using this one pretty much. I feel like that's what I do. I like use it for like a solid month. I'm like, you know what, Gloria, you've used that a lot and you obviously love the palette. Let's go buy the other one, which is just, yeah, it's just, yeah, I try to justify everything and it just doesn't, it doesn't make sense half the time. But I have been loving this palette this month. Um, it's so great. You can make many looks with that. I'm not the biggest fan of these glitter shades here. I feel like they're very, like, clustery. They're very, like, thick. I don't know. But it looks good with a glitter glue. Um, the Too Faced Glitter Glue is my absolute favourite. It is an absolute game changer. If you don't have it, you really need to get your hands on it because it can just take your eyeshadow to the next level. I love it so much. These shades here, the matte shades and, like, also, like, moon dust angelic and blessed have been using that and i actually really really like it i think they're super super pretty shades i really really like it. and you've got your black which you always need a black shadow in the palette i feel um and yeah i have been absolutely loving this palette i still don't know if i'm gonna pick up the new one but i feel like i've justified it enough but i'd love to know what you guys think about the new one if you have it or what you think about this palette and let me know what you think and you know if you have any tips or tricks on ways to better use those. You, I know that you can't use a brush. Well, I personally can't use a brush. It does not work for me. I have to use my fingers. Um, but yeah, so let me know if you have the new Huda Beauty palette or if you have this one and just let me know what you think about it. And let me know if I should justify buying the new one. Let me know. If you if you love this, say yes, then I think we'll have to get it. But yeah, so I have been loving this for the month of October. 
The next thing I have been loving is so random, but I've been loving it. It is this Sigent portable charger. It's currently dead because I've used all up flashing. This thing has been the biggest lifesaver. I just, I don't know what I did with my phone like before this. In the biggest lifesaver, I have the iPhone 6 Plus, which is pretty old now because now they have like the 7 they have the 7 and now they have like the 8 and then they're having like the, the x1 the 10 one or something like that i am just i want to get the x1 because like it looks super cool but i am just sticking with this right now because it does work fine except the battery does go at a rapid pace like it could be on like 80 percent and then go down to 50 and then go down to 25 and then go down to like 18 plug it into the charger and then it goes back up to 50 i'm just like huh like what so yeah i don't know what is going on with my iphone right now but this thing has been an absolute lifesaver so all you need is the attachment cord for your iphone and you just plug it in this um charges your phone fully two times around i think you can get up to like five or something like that you can get one that like charges your phone five times um yeah, but this one charges it twice around. I absolutely love it. I got this from JB Hi5. I'm not too sure how much it was, but I know it was not that expensive. So I absolutely love that. And if your phone is weird like mine and just, you know, the battery just all over the place, I highly recommend this. This would be just like, it'll save your life. The next thing I have been loving now, I've had this for a couple of months um, and I haven't used it. I only used it this month. And I thought it was going to be a weird texture, but it actually wasn't. And I got it as a gift from a friend. Um, and it's the, the Milani um, Metallic Lip Cream in 01 um, Chromatic Addict. Now, this thing is super, super nice. It's actually matte, which I found, like, weird. I thought it was going to be a gloss. I didn't really read it. I'm just going to swatch it so you can see. I am absolutely in love with this shade. Like, in love. I don't know if you can see it. It is stunning i'm absolutely just like shocked at how amazing it works how amazing it sits on my lips i love this thing so much and i mean it's rose gold like do i have to say any more it's rose gold it's so pretty so yeah i have been loving that i think i've been loving this month is the tart clean queen vegan roll-on deodorant this thing is number one super cute i love tart packaging they just they just get me they get they get me like i'm just like I just buy it for the packaging. Like, literally, the struggle is real. But I have been absolutely obsessed with this. Number one, it is super cute, super convenient. Look how small it is. Like, that's compared to my hand. And I have pretty average hands, actually. So, not too small, not too big hands. But they, it's just so cute to keep in your handbag. Freshen up. I love it. It smells like powder. It really doesn't smell like anything special. But it just takes away the stench. I have been absolutely loving this so much keeping my handbag is a lifesaver so yeah so next thing i've been loving i've been using this for a couple of months now because you need to use it for a couple of months so you can see if like it needs to grow and it's the rodent plus fields enhancement lash boost now this thing is super expensive like i'm not gonna lie it is crazy expensive now i got this off a friend's friend and it was 180 dollars australian dollars so that is super crazy but i was like you know what i need to try it because you know i feel like if you don't try it you don't know guys this is the absolute best thing that has ever fallen into my life like i've ever bought like literally it is absolutely amazing my lashes are so long i get so much compliments on them people think i'm wearing um lash extensions and falsies half the time and i don't feel like i need to wear falsies anymore and literally all you do is you use that night before you go to bed you just apply a thin layer where you would put like eyeliner just above your eyelashes and that's it and it dries in 90 seconds and honestly it is the most amazing product i highly recommend i know it's expensive it lasts quite a bit because you only need a small amount and i absolutely love this thing i highly recommend it to anyone that wants to get long lashes and just you know you can flutter them around that's pretty much what i've been doing like yeah, can you notice my eyelashes? But literally, I have been obsessed with this. This has been part of my nighttime routine for a couple of months now. I mean, I'm a bit lazy some nights, but most nights I do put this on and I absolutely love it. I highly recommend if you're looking for a lash serum. The next thing I have been loving is I love essential oils. I have an oil diffuser. I love it so much. I feel like it actually does change like your mood and you know whatever scent you put in i feel like it does like affect the way you feel and i love things like that 
So I actually picked this up from iHerb and it's the Now Essential Oils Peaceful Sleep Sleep Blend. It looks like this. I love iHerb by the way guys, I just buy everything off iHerb. If you follow me on Instagram, you would know that. Um, so this has um, orange oil, tangerine oil, lavender oil, cam chamomile oil, um, lang lang oil, sandwood blend. Um, and yeah, so it smells very orangey. And I don't like the scent of orange, I find, them, I find, I don't know, I don't really like orange things. I don't mind eating the fruit, but I don't like the artificial like lollies. Um, orange flavor I don't like the scent of orange stuff um yeah I'm just not the biggest fan of oranges but this thing has actually changed my sleeping game whenever I feel like I'm just overtired or I just can't sleep I literally put a couple of drops in, in my oil diffuser and I let that go on for like four hours that's the maximum I can set my oil diffuser for four hours and it just the aroma goes around in my room and I'm knocked out and I'm having like trouble sleeping or you just want to have a deeper sleep if you're a lightsaber like I am then I highly recommend it the next thing I have been loving is my key I'm pretty sure they're called jet lag sunnies these things have just been my like go-to sunnies recently I know they are super oversized but you know what you just gotta rock it and it covers half your face so when you're not wearing makeup perfect so i have been absolutely loving these i love the reflective lens in the rose gold tone so yeah i just obsessed pretty much obsessed so yeah these little babies have been my favorite sunnies for the month my next favorite is like this weird obsession i've been having recently i don't know what it is like i love them all the time but only recently i've just been obsessed with them and it's m ms i have been addicted to m ms I actually have a weird obsession with them. Like, how do you go wrong with a classic? Like, M&M's are amazing. So I've literally been obsessed with M&M's. It's like been my weird thing for the month. I feel like I have certain food trends that like I'm obsessed with for a month. After I get over it, like after I like eat it non-stop for a month, I kind of get over it and then I stop eating them. So I probably won't be eating these for a while, like after a couple of weeks. But at the moment I have been obsessed with them how can you go wrong with m and And that's it for my October favourites. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and also follow me on Instagram so we can have chit chats. And let me know in the comments down below what your October favourites were. I'd love to know. And if you have any weird food obsessions, let me know what your current food obsession is right now. Because I'm always looking for a new food obsession. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And thank you so much for being part of the Harvey Barbie squad. We are the best squad ever. And I will chit chat with you guys soon. Sorry guys, I've been a bit delayed on videos. It has been super crazy. I am going to try and post every second week or weekly. I'm just going to see how it goes. Um, let me know also if you're happy for me to do some vlogs. Because like I actually want to do vlogs. I love watching what people get up to. So yeah, let me know if you would be happy to see some vlogs. Thank you so much for watching. Happy Barbie Squad. You are amazing. Don't forget that. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.